Do you know about TEDx? Do you know, have you ever seen any of these talks? Well, there's a young lady in the station with me right now. Her name is McKenna Lautner. She is a high school student over at Valencia High School. And she is going to be part of one of the, it's, first of all, thrilled to be part of one of the few high schools, is what I'm reading, in the nation, licensed to be part of the TED Global Community. McKenna, welcome to KHTS. Hi. All right, so the theme you chose for your TED Talk is unexpected. Now, just, just being a human being, walking the planet, there's so many unexpected things that happen, but you, as a young person, and you never, one, expected to be put in a TED Talk, and you've had some things that led to this moment that happened to you, and as I said before we went on air, Mother Nature came in and just basically, you know, wicked banks she is, kicks you right in the teeth. I don't want you to go into the great details, because I know your talk is going to be all about that, but you actually had something catastrophic that changed your life. What were you involved in before that came about? Um, ever since I was 13 years old, I played volleyball on a number three ranked team my sophomore year, and I tore my ACL, and then I had a heart condition after I came back after that. So through doing these TED Talks, I just wanted to inspire people that when you face unexpected circumstances in life, you should fill it with something good rather than just giving up. And the idea that you look to sports heroes, and I and I told you before we went on air, I'm the worst because <laughs> I don't know sports, but I know the word Super Bowl champ that has to do with football. A gentleman by the name of Ray Lewis gave a quote that you've kind of, that's, that's your motto. Tell me what it is. Um, it's when you challenge a warrior, a warrior will respond and that's really helped me because I've I'm 5'5 five five, so volleyball you have to be like six foot to make it in the front row so that's helped me to challenge myself to never give up on that and I love that you didn't hang your hat just on one thing it's like okay that's great but you you understood and realized there are other great things you could be doing mm -hmm. and despite the fact you had a medical issue and you've had some other things that pulled you from that you just said you know what twist turns, injuries, health, whatever it is, you're going to fill that hole because it was, that was, a, that was a great passion of yeah. yours, wasn't it? Yeah, it, it was really hard. And the message that I'm trying to give up is just to not give up. And I didn't want to just like sit down and pout that I couldn't play volleyball anymore. So I wanted to do something that could help other people and hopefully leave at Valencia High School for a long time after this. I like you. You could be my friend because <laughs> I feel like, you know, life is not what happens to you. Life is what you do with mm -hmm. what happens. Yes. And I think your story is remarkable. We can all hear your story at this TEDx talk. Also very exciting that you're doing this because, again, one of the few high schools in the nation, very big place, <laughs> in the nation licensed to be part of the TED Global Community. You are going to do this on March 15th, which is a Tuesday from 4 p.m. to 8 p.m. It's taking place at Real Life Church in Valencia because it is a great auditorium mm -hmm. and an excellent stage with a lot of cap um, uh, capabilities. Your website, unexpectedvhs.com, this is a remarkable talk you're going to give. I know that. Today we only get a chance to hear a tiny little section of it, but you're looking for partners and sponsors to help with this. It's not a tremendous amount of money, but it does take money to put this on. This is on your website, uh, tickets, speakers, sponsorships. Tell me a little bit about speakers. Um, so we have Ray Lewis, a Super Bowl champion, and Christina Perry. She sings oh, yes. a few songs. We, we play her on the station all the time. Human, Thousand Years. Mm -hmm. She's one of my most favorite singer-songwriters. And then who else? Um, we have a artist. His name is Jerry. Jared Emerson and then we have Jason Russell he did Invisible Children in Coney 2012 oh that was a big thing mm -hmm. and then we have Sean Gordon and Shalene Bryan this is they're all going to be a part of this yep they all do about 18 minute talks Wow, this is phenomenal. And now, to be part of TEDx, is this something you sought out, or how did this come mm -hmm. about? Um, my best friend, he went to Oaks Christian, and he had too many concussions, so he couldn't play football anymore. Mm. So I just followed him. How old, his, by the way? He's now a freshman at Pepperdine. 
Okay, so he had to stop because of concussions mm-hmm. in just regular sports here. In, okay, continue. Yeah. So I just always looked up to him and wanted to do the same thing and just follow in his footsteps. And so you were inspired by him. Mm-hmm. And you know firsthand that you can be inspired by someone your age, your peers, and you want to return that favor. Would that be right? Yes, Exactly. So, again, McKenna Lautner, we're speaking with, who's going to be part of a TEDx event. This is taking place on March 15th. It's a Tuesday from 4 p.m. to 8 p.m. I'm going to have to see if they're going to let me leave for this because I would I very much want to be a part of this. Your story is remarkable. And again, we're not going into tremendous detail about the health issues that, that took you out of sports, but the idea that at a very early age, you decided to, to let your mantra be, when you challenge a warrior, a warrior responds. What do you want to do with your life? Now that we're, we're doing this TEDx thing, this is the beginning. Again, looking for partners and sponsorships. Go to unexpectedvhs.com. What do you What do you want to do with your life? Um, I would like to do something in this area with like TED Talks and, or something like that. I'm going to Belmont in Nashville, and I'm hoping to start doing TEDx Talks there, too. They asked if I would be interested in doing it, so I think that would be exciting. And... Um, Tickets also go, you can email unexpectedvhs at gmail.com or you can come on February 23 and 24 to the Valencia Library from 4 to 7.30 p.m. to get them. Okay, repeat that for me. (laughs) (laughs) You can get them on unexpectedvhs at gmail.com or you can come to the Valencia High School Library from 4 to 7.30 And again, if you would like to support McKenna Lautner in this TEDx talk, again, the speakers, Ray Lewis, Super Bowl champion, singer-songwriter Christina Perry, Sean Gordon, the director of Project Bayview, Jason Russell, the co-founder of Invisible Children, director of Coney 2012, Shalene Bryan, founder of Skip One, author, speaker, and Jared Emerson, who's an amazing artist. You want to find all this out on their website, and you want to support this young lady, unexpectedvhs.com. McKenna Lautner, thank you for being here. Thank you. And again, you're going to have to put in a good word so they let me out to come hear your talk. (laughs) I want to be a part of that. Okay, I will. Thank you so much. Thank you.